I'm here today in our warehouse to answer the question of what you really get from a Tesla Powerwall when the power goes out. If you're gonna add one of these batteries to your home solar system, you need to know what you can back up and how many batteries it's gonna take. So let's dive in and answer those questions. What you get during a power outage from your Tesla Powerwall is really dependent on what you want backed up and how many power walls you need to have make that happen. So as we're exploring this with homeowners, each home is so unique and has different energy needs that we typically go through a checklist with you. So outside of doing that for your individual home, what we can do is talk about some general things that are on that checklist that can help you determine what you could get from your power wall. So if we start with a single power wall application, so what we would call a partial home backup, what we're talking about here is people that are just looking for a few core items to stay on during a power outage. With a single power wall, you can keep on your lights, most of your outlets, you can run some of your small appliances. Uh, you can even keep on your Wi-Fi router and your refrigerator and freezer. Um, if you want much more than that, you're gonna need to bump up to a whole home backup with either two or three power walls. And so when you move into the from the one power wall system with sort of the core things that you might want to keep on during an outage. When you move from that to a two power wall system, you keep everything in the first set, but you also can add things like an air conditioning system, like your electric stove, an electric dryer, even a smaller 30 amp EV charger. Uh, and so going from one to two really does move you into that almost whole home backup scenario. But if you, you know, have larger energy needs or you have, you know, certain things like an electric heat pump or you want to run your 50 amp EV charger, then you would need to bump up to three or more power walls to make that happen. And the reason for this has to do with amperage loads and how much one, two or three power walls can take when these devices are all running uh, at the same time. So no matter which option you choose, uh, you know, each one provides a different layer of backup protection when the power goes out. Along with solar batteries, one of the things we're excited about now is a new product called a Span Smart Panel. And it's a smart electric panel that when paired with batteries gives you even more flexibility when the grid goes down because you can in real time from an app on your phone decide what you want to run or what you want to turn off in your home. And see, this can extend the life of your battery by allowing you to choose what is running or what is off when the power goes out. While each home is different and unique, what you really get across the board with a Tesla Powerwall system is peace of mind, knowing that your home will be backed up and ready when the power goes out. If you wanna talk a little bit more about your specific home's needs, get in touch. Our solar educators are here ready to chat and answer questions to help determine if a solar and battery system is right for you. Otherwise, thanks for joining us to learn a little bit more about what you really get from a Tesla Powerwall when the power goes out. We'll see you next time.